Howard, how are you today? I'm doing, always doing fine, Albert. <laughs> how could you have a bad day when you're playing with trains? <laughs> yes, yes, trains is great. And we're going to call this episode uh, Ribbed Car Madness. Well, ribbed is also outside frame and also single sheath. The several names for these box cars. Mm -hmm. All right, and these these are all cars you made in the What If series. What If series, yeah. Mm -hmm. And let's talk about them. Let's a bunch of them here we can pick up and feature for today's well, episode. Well, pictures worth a thousand words. You could probably scan over these. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's let's take a quick look first. Oh, these are beautiful. And these are about what? About 60 footers? Some are 50s, some are 60s, some are 40s. Mm. That's a furniture one. This one is a, uh, what is it? A Georgia furniture car of some Well, here, kind. I believe. Yeah. Uh, this one here would be, uh, that's uh, Georgia and Florida. All right. And then the I, next... try to, I try to use obscure roads. Yes. Uh, and uh, K4 decals, this has plenty of obscure decals. This is uh, Pittsburgh and West Virginia, oh, Peoria and Eastern. All right, let this me just is, take a uh, quick look at this. New York Central, Peoria and Eastern. Wow. This is C and L. I have no idea what the hell that is, but I'm sure it's obscure. All right, let's start uh, the, at the top one. This one here would be uh, shit on a stick. Uh, what the, oh, uh, Detroit, Toledo and Ironton. All right, let's... DT and I. This is Pennsylvania and Reading. Or Reading, wow. our PNR, Pennsylvania and Reading. Yeah. Okay. This one here would be uh, Lehigh Valley. All right, let's just take a uh, This is also point. Lehigh Valley. Now, Lehigh Valley, a lot of times the cars, the doors went caddy wampus, went this way. Mm -hmm. But uh, again, this is imaginative. Uh, right, uh, wow. Let's, let me get a shot of. Uh, wow. Let me just show folks. Now, be careful when you lean these up this way because you have a tendency to hit the ladder. It's very delicate. Oh, mm. yeah. So I want to pick it up this way. Mm. And uh, you want to break the ladders off. That's another. Mm. That's Lehigh Valley. Valley. Mm -hmm. And then let's go over to these guys over here. Uh, this set of a gun here is, uh, oh, that's Georgia Central. This is Big Four, which is part of New York Central. This is Reading. This is Chicago, Kansas, and Nebraska. Um, part of the Burlington route, I think. Mm. Uh, this over here is Western Maryland, mm. weathered. This is Western Maryland, unweathered. This is Wichita. Uh, Northwestern. I've oh. never heard of that one. Yeah. That's why it's obscure. And this is, uh, what the hell, what does that say? Streamliner. Let me see. Let me see that. I can read this. Oh, this is Central Georgia. Mm. Okay, Central Georgia car. Mm. Now, these all have underbody details. And uh, again, this is part of the 500 I built during the, the COVID three years. Uh -huh. My, uh, mm. I wasn't going to sit down and wait to catch COVID, so I just uh, started working at the shop every day wow. and had a grand time. Mm. Let's, I'm going to show the under. Let's mm. flip that one over oh, so sure. we can. Mm. All of these have the Howard Zane uh, sticker now, on them. Now, there's no guarantee that that's accurate. It looks good, then. That's all I care about. Right. Mm. Nobody's going to agree that. Mm. No, they're really, Again, really. Again, these are imaginative, and uh, it goes back to my... Um, the way I see the hobby as limitless imagination. It's a hobby all about imagination. Mm -hmm. At least it was, and it still is with me. Right, and it is with me as well. Good. I'm glad to hear that. Yeah, you, you yeah, certainly are, are imaginative. Huh? And folks, these cars are selling. Um, we sold, let's uh, see, uh, almost, uh, well, let's see, before you got on, I had 142. So you sold, what, uh, 25? Yeah. Okay, so it's uh, not bad. Yeah, they are selling, and you know these are one of a kinds. And uh, mm. when these are gone, they well, I'll know, build more. You know, hopefully, if I'm still alive. Yeah, as long as I can breathe, and get into my <laughs> shop, I'll build these some bitches. <laughs> so, you know, well, you, they, you know, they'd yeah. be different. Everything yeah. is different. Nothing, no two are exactly the same. Uh, but, no, no, and I've that's never, never, ever, ever built two cars the same. Right, they might be close, but not the same. Right, there'll be some little details are different. Let's just pan, and we're going to feature these cars uh, every week on the channel, but there's okay. still a good selection. Of... Well, the thing we should talk about, that these cars... Now, I've built uh, Sunshine cars and kids. Mm -hmm. I've built Westerfield cars. I've built uh, Fenera and Camerlingo. Mm -hmm. And uh, the better you build them, the more it looks like a plastic car. Oh. And there's, as I said, we, saw, we talked about this before. There's a certain panache to a all wooden car uh -huh. and uh, only if you have a wooden car would you know this 
Right. And uh, all my rolling stock is wood now. I don't have any. The only thing plastic now are tank cars, and I'm trying to figure out how to scratch build those. Mm -hmm. And what I do, I've got about 100 tank cars I'm going to give away Ooh. or sell at a reasonable Ooh. price. I haven't quite figured that out yet. Yeah, I'm going to grab do it. just... Uh, you know, we're talking about the panache of a wood car, and all these are wood. Oh, yeah, all wood. Yeah. All weathered with pastels. Now, that I use uh, pastel. Oopsie. Oh. Way to go, Al. Oh. <laughs> you buy can, that sucker, you catch it before it fell you, to the floor. You've been doing push-ups from here to yeah. the end. Oh, yeah, I'm mowing the lawn and raking yeah. the leaves. Yeah. Now, push-ups are fun. Yeah. Wow, Howard. Yeah, these are... You handpicked these today. I picked a bunch of colorful yeah. reefers. Well, we picked all of the outside frame ones. Mm -hmm. Right. Now, remember the several names, the single sheathed, outside frame, outside braced, whatever. Mm -hmm. These cars were prevalent during the 20s and 30s, and they ran all the way up through the 60s mm -hmm. until the final day, the uh, ICC or FRA, whatever. Mm -hmm. so, no, no more. Mm -hmm. Well, I really like this New York Central one. Part of the New York Central system. Well, folks, now, I... Eat, well, one, one thing. Oh. Even the prototypes of these things were wood. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. We're not trying to simulate wood metal because we can't. Right. Well, folks, uh, if you watch the channel, I did Reefer Madness twice. So there's other episodes of a lot of the Reefer cars we have for sale. And we're going to do... I'll do another episode of the longer 50-foot plus 60-foot, 50, 60-foot Reefers. We just did an episode, Reefer Madness, on a lot of the... The smaller reefers, you can see that on the channel. If you see anything you like there, you can let me know. And we use uh, Priority Mail, United States Post Office. So okay. it behooves you to buy more than one. Yeah, I should mention that all the wheels are all the wheel sets are metal. Okay. All the couplers are KD number five, which I find to be the best universal coupler. I tried the KD fifty eights, but somehow they don't like the number fives hmm. as far as matching up. So I got rid of them. Okay, but um, when we ship them, it, it behooves you because the the normal shipping rate in the United States is around seventeen fifty for a car, and you can fit about three or four cars in that box. Um, but if you want to get one car, that's fine. But you can save on shipping, and then there has been a price increase on these. But you can contact me at alpug one at verizon dot net. Well, don't forget the bundling. We also, if you buy five cars, you get a 10% discount. Right. And these particular cars, we're going to have at a special price uh, for my channel. So you can contact me at alpug1 at verizon.net, and I'll give you the pricing information on the cars. And let me know what cars you're interested in, or whether you want all the cars, or just some of the cars, or even if it's one car. Contact me at the email address on the link on the video. Howard, I appreciate it, and thanks for this episode. Well, thank you, Al.